Hi everyone, this is Björn from the initiative Step Up for Children's Rights and this is a video for Not Profane. He is a YouTuber and Christian music artist and here comes uh, my Giving Tuesday challenge for him. If you guys don't know what Giving Tuesday is, well then check out hashtag Giving Tuesday on Facebook, on Twitter and you'll find, it out, find out what it is. It's a great movement all around the world where literally millions and millions of people all around the globe are doing good for other people on a specific day and that's giving tuesday this year it is uh, november 27th and so it's only a few more days to come and then we'll have giving tuesday so what is this challenge all about for not profane well we as uh, initiative step up for children's rights uh, we are deeply concerned about things that are happening in norway in europe Europe, where hundreds and hundreds of children are being taken away uh, from their families by the local authorities, by the local child welfare services called Barneverne. And there are hundreds and hundreds of parents in Norway who are fighting for the right to raise their own children. And one of them is the American citizen Amy Jacobson. She is fighting to regain custody over her son Tyler. Uh, hi, uh, it's Amy Jacobson that's calling. Uh, I was in the U.S. Embassy in Oslo earlier today um, because the Norwegian government, they have, they have legally kidnapped my child and I need help. Amy was accused of still nursing Tyler when Tyler was 19 months old and doctors told her that Tyler should not weigh 9.6 kilo but 10 kilos. Even though it's uh, still okay according to growth charts for a boy Tyler's age to weigh 9.6 kilos. But Barneverne, the Norwegian Child Welfare Services, they thought they knew better and they seized Tyler right away without uh, properly looking into the situation, without even offering any help for the family. They seized the child. That happened in July 2013. And then a little more than a year later, in September 2014, both parents, uh, Amy is an American citizen and Kevin, the father, is Norwegian citizen. Both parents lost parental and visitation rights. So they're no longer allowed to see their child and they have no idea where the child is. Um, the authorities even changed the name twice so that the parents would not be able to locate the child. And what happened is that uh, I have met with them. I've met Amy, I've met Kevin, the father, and uh, I've seen the case documents. And in the case documents, it says that the main reason why they're not allowed to see their child, well, guess what? That's the American citizenship of the mother of Amy. The authorities are concerned that Amy and both Kevin uh, would take Tyler, their own child, who is an American citizen, they're concerned that they would take the child back to America. And they're concerned that they would no longer have full control over the child. And this is uh, a clear case of government overreach. And this was even confirmed by an international Christian, uh, by, by a group of international Christian lawyers that we uh, had contacted. We had asked them to look at the case papers and give their insight. And they said uh, there are human rights violations taking place here. And also what you can clearly see is uh, uh, there's a clear violation of Article 9 on the UN Convention of the Child. So this is really horrible and we must raise awareness on this case before it is too late. Because in September of 2018, so uh, just a few weeks ago, the uh, CPS court in Norway has decided that they want to grant uh, forced adoption on behalf of the foster parents. Uh, Amy has already appealed this and the Court of Appeal will take place uh, early 2019, probably in January. But if she loses that, she will lose her child forever and then she would even lose the right to fight for her child. 
So we must take action now so that Amy would at least get visitation rights back, but hopefully get her child back because the child belongs to the parents, to the mother, doesn't it? And therefore, I'd like to challenge you uh, with three things. Uh, number one, sign the petition uh, that I've linked here in this video. Um, and then number two is print out this poster, no, Norway Return Tyler to Amy. Ask somebody to take a photo of you with, with the uh, poster or just take a selfie. And then post this photo on Facebook as your profile photo. Uh, publish this photo with the hashtag free Tyler so that it can actually be found. Uh, and then invite some others to do so as well. And number three, since you are a YouTuber, please post a video, a short video where you raise awareness, where you invite other people to do so as well. So these are three options. Well, I give you a fourth one, uh, but this is optional. Um, if God puts it on your heart, then please write a song for Tyler since you're a musician. Okay. These challenges I leave you with. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your great music. Keep up the good work and God bless you.